I've always liked Ben Askren. Don't, I, don't bring up the day. I don't you dare bring up that effing Damian Meyer fight again. No, nah, I wasn't. I was just gonna say I'm so one. Happy. I do have one thing. Yeah, I'll start. For, I can start. We can start. We can. Me and Aljo can start picking out fights on you. Don't you bring up that Shoney <laughs> Carter fight. Listen to me. I am Shoney hungry. Carter. You know why? Listen. I might have lost to George Mazzola. They remind me you lost to Shoney Carter. I, I, I did. You prick. You listen to me. I'm not gonna call you a prick with your kids in the car. <laughs> This is why oh I'm gosh. humble. Ben Askren, listen to me. Matt, boom, boom. Don't get oh. me. Don't, don't start the boom roasting sh stuff with me. Listen to Matt, me. One time, Shoney Carter showed up at Duke Rufus' gym. This is like <laughs> 2012, probably my first year, maybe, yeah. maybe possibly second year there. I literally could not <laughs> believe how bad he was. It Let was me tell like you. I, I'm kicking his ass striking. Like, what's going on here? He's terrible. I agree 110%. <laughs> I rolled with him on tough four, and I couldn't believe it either. But listen, Ben, put that same dude in a Speedo <laughs> and grease him up. And you're it's like holding a wet fish. You try listen to me. You ever see an episode of cops when they're trying to control the guy and he's all oily and they can't get him? Try dealing with that stuff. You know what I mean? Wow. So and don't I listen, I, let's not bring up I won the rematch. All right, Ben. <laughs> wait, wait, anyway, no, I do have something. I have something. Oh wait, what'd you have what'd you have for Ben? I, I have to say this. I have to. I feel like the, the community What is it? The wrestling community, the grappling community wants to know. And I this is mainly for me because I'm I am kind of a selfish guy when it comes to like the people yeah. you, you the people you like watching. I do feel like there's a little bit, and this is no disrespect. I mean this in the best way possible. I feel like we we don't get the opportunity to see you go out on top. You know what I mean? I feel like yeah. to to go out like that when I know you still have more in the tank. The selfish side of me. I get the injury. I heard you talking yeah. about the hip and everything. But, here, but, but the other Aljo, side. I, I don't really have more in the tank. I, I mean, literally, I missed you guys first of all. I was talking to my doctor about my hip. Um, man, that, it, it's a nightmare. I uh, And I didn't talk about it because it, it, to me, it wasn't really relevant. Either I was going to win with what I had or I wasn't going to win with what I had. Um, but, dude, I was I was in doing a couple of private lessons with 150-pound kids on Sunday and, and struggling to get uh, – you know, to get myself moving the right way. And, uh, so I don't have, I don't think I have too much left, if, if any, at all. Um, I'll probably have this surgery within the next couple months. And uh, yeah, I, I, you know, I'm, I'm kind of at peace with what I've been able to do. And uh, it's unfortunate that uh, I wasn't able to top, but man, very few of us are. Yeah. Well, listen, man, I, first of all, I like your, I, I say, it's going to show my age when I say Eddie Haskell. But I like your like Weisenheimer attitude. I think it's truly you. And I'm gonna I think the what's great about the UFC, besides all the fighting styles, is the characters that are in the UFC. And you, Ben Askren, are a character. I'm gonna miss see, I'm gonna miss watching you fight. And uh thank you for hanging out with us. I appreciate uh, it, guys. Hey, ben, before I let you go, I'll let you ask me. Yeah. Go ahead, ask me how it feels to be a UFC champion. <laughs> All right, Ben, <laughs> listen to me. We're out of here. Oh, I thought you were going to ask me how it felt to have hair. No, <laughs> listen to me. If you put that mop on this head, I'm going to lose fans. Ben, I had such a good time you're with you. Fans. You're, you're in that, your phone won't stop ringing off the hook from girls. Well, then that's going to affect my marriage, Ben. Now that's where I draw hey, the line. Matt, Listen to we, me. Can all, we can all say, like, you know, I know people mess with me for my physique, but, you know, if we put us next to each other, I still look, probably look pretty good. Next to who? You. Well, listen to me. Beauty is in the eye of, uh, you know how that goes, Ben Askren. Don't put us up. Don't put me and you next to each other and uh, put up a poll and let's see. You might get fucking oh, boom roasted. If, if, we have, if we have our shirts off, oh. I mean, if I'm next to Aljo, I'm not winning. If I'm next to you, oh, I, I don't know. I like my chances. Listen, listen let me tell you something. <laughs> yeah. look, look at the latest one of looking for a fight. 45 with my abs. I've been off the gluten. Anyway, Ben. Thank you for hanging out with us. All right. Good times, All right. Ben Askren. Thank you. Thank you. Have a good day. Take care, Later. bro. That was fun. Okay. <laughs> I didn't think you guys were gonna stop. <laughs> oh, I think I think we can. I think we can. We can go for a while. I think we can go back and forth with that. <laughs>
You know I what I mean? Like, Who's going to stop first? Well, I mean, I just think he wanted the last word in. I could have, I wasn't backing down, you know? I just wanted him to know. I, he might want to know what it's like to be a UFC yeah. champ. I just got to ask him. But uh, listen, uh, I get a miss his personality. That was a good one. Hey, listen, sometimes you got good, you know, you got good jabs. I got good verbal jabs. Yeah. You know what I mean?